In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Black Myth Wukong crashing, freezing, lagging, glitches and all those things. So in case you're experiencing any of the things I just said, this really video will help you out. Now, for the first thing we're gonna do, and this is probably the most important one, is first close down Steam completely. And the way you do this is not just by pressing here on the red X key. What you wanna do is go down here uh, where your taskbar is and then show hidden icons, right click on your Steam and click exit Steam. Then Steam will start shutting down. Now, in some cases, this will not close Steam down completely. So what you need to do to do it is right click on your taskbar, go to task manager and up here up, up top, type in Steam. If there's nothing popping up, that's great. You've successfully shut down Steam. If there is anything that pops up, what you want to do is simply click on Steam and then click End Task and Steam will shut down completely. Once you've done that, you want to look for Steam in here inside your kind of Windows search, okay? So simply type in Steam and then you want to right click on the app and press Run as Administrator. Now you may have to enter in your admin pin. If it asks you to, just do it. And then in a second, your Steam will open up. Now, when Steam opens up, it's important to then try and run the game, so the Black Myth Wukong game, via Steam and not via your desktop shortcut, okay? That's very important. Now, why? I'll show you in a second over here. So, if I go to Library, and now you want to look for, of course, your Black Myth Wukong game, and you want to click that Play button over here, okay? So... That's because you've now started Steam as an admin and it will also start all the apps open via Steam as an admin too. So that's why you should do this. Now, if this helped, that's great. And just the easiest way would be to always open Steam as admin when you open your computer or, or before gaming. And then this will help you out. Now, the second thing you can try doing, I don't have Wukong installed on this uh, Steam account. So I'm going to show you the different game over here. But do the exact same thing I'm going to show you, okay? What you want to do is simply right click on your Wukong game and go to properties. Then you want to go to installed files in here and then you want to click verify integrity of game files. What this will do, it will scan through all your uh, files that were generated when you were downloading and installing your game to your computer. It will look for any uh, kind of bad files that got damaged or corrupted. It will replace those files and fix the game for you. And then next time you run it, hopefully it will run much smoother and much better than it did before. Now, the next thing you can do is also, yet again, go over here, right click on your Wukong game and go to properties again. And then under general, you want to type into launch options dash DX11, okay? Then you want to close this down and simply run the game. If that didn't help a lot, you can also try doing it again by going to properties again and typing in dash DX12, okay? So once you do that, close it down and run the game again. If that didn't help either, what you could do is simply go back, delete it, and then you're done, you can close this down and run the game again. Sometimes it's this third time when it fixes the issues and the game starts working smoothly. Now, that's one thing you can do, as I said. Now, the next thing you can do is find your Black Myth Wukong game, wherever it is, so I'll show you how to find it. You want to right-click on your Black Myth Wukong over here, click Properties yet again, and then what you want to do is go over here where it says Installed Files. You then want to click Browse, and this will open up your folder where the game is located, okay? So you want to look for this game, okay? And inside, there will be an exe file. There, there usually isn't as many files as uh, it is on my screen right now. However, you have to look for an exe file that has the Wukong icon. So for me, I opened up the, uh, the directory of One's Human, and it's this one. So what you want to do with this, you want to right-click it and click Properties. In here, you want to navigate yourself into compatibility mode. In here, you want to check run this program in compatibility mode 4, and then you want to select Windows 8 from the drop-down menu. Now, it's usually automatically selected, but if it isn't, just click it and select Windows 8. You also want to disable full screen optimizations, and also, yet again, check run this program as an administrator. Now, this could help a lot of your issues, and could probably and will probably solve all your crashing, glitching, and stuff like that. You then want to press apply and okay. 
Now, once you do that, you want to run the game over here via this file by double clicking it and the game will launch up. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all the main things you can do to fix your Black Myth Wukong game crashing, freezing, lagging, glitching and stuff like that. I hope this video helped you out and if it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.